uh, your name? Gary Riddle. Gary Rocky Riddle. That's it. And when were you born? <laughs> January 31st, 1961. Born in Mount Pleasant, Utah, but I grew up in Spring Glen between Price and Help. As far as the eye can see, we see amazing habitat right along the Idaho border. And this is, Gary, this is beautiful up here. My son got me to move up. And yeah. it is beautiful, and we haven't regretted it a bit. We could go out right of our right out of our back door and hunt pheasants and started with a springer as a child and went right along and enjoyed them and had great times hunting ducks, pheasants, chuckers, grouse. We hunted everything. I have these dogs is because of my love for hunting. That's why I train these and I, it's something that'll stay with me. I can almost tell you the exact steps, everything about it and that's why I do it. Each one of the dogs that I train has abilities that are unique to their character. Every single one had the ability to find birds. nice dogs out here. Yes there are. About half of them I've trained. I am very competitive and I always want to stay competitive and I'm really driven to be successful in field trials. So I'm always looking for the perfect dog and the next champion. I enjoy the training and that's why I can do the long days of work because I really enjoy working with the individual dogs. I want to champion dogs, but the main thing is I want to make each dog that I work with better and competitive. I want them to attain their goals and their highest abilities. Do you have a dog out here today? Yes, Betty. My husband's running Betty. She'll be the second dog up. What makes Betty special? Oh, she's a stylish little number and she's awful fast. <laughs> What, what, where, where do they go to that next level? For me, it's pattern and bird finding. It's been a great week. Uh, we have four that we brought from Nebraska. My pro has seven and one of them's mine. What drives you guys to do this? Well, I love being able to compete while uh, having and watching your dog. It's pretty fun out there. 
I once I had a professional trainer that I really respected. Uh, I'll use his name, Dick Vermazen. He is brilliant. He always told me, I will share all of my training techniques with you because I can see the issues beforehand and I'll beat you. With, I'll beat you. And as I've worked with multiple dogs and seen this on multiple occasions, I agree with that. I have the ability to see something in the dog. And so the dogs that have the unique capabilities and talents, I see, but I can deal with issues before they may become an issue. The sooner I can get a dog and have the opportunity to develop rapport and to work through those issues, the more competitive the dog will be. What's your dog? I like dogs that find birds. <laughs> and they have to find them within gun range so you can shoot them. A lot of guys are, are really, really concerned about genetics. They want a dog who's an athlete. They want a dog who can find birds. Uh, I will say this. The, the dog who wins the trial is a dog who's a, to, a, a whole package. He'll be a dog that's finding birds and running like the wind and, and, and listening. He'll have it all. Because I love to see the dogs work, it's helped me be a better person, I feel like. I grew up hunting springers as a kid. Always liked to do it. And uh, I had a junior high teacher said, you can make a living doing anything you want if you put your mind to it. So I did. So what is the end goal? I want to win more nationals.